Hey guys, in today's video, I'm gonna tell you the best way to store your cryptocurrencies so that they are safe and nobody can steal them. This is a very important video. If you have cryptocurrencies and you want to keep them safe. So stay tuned. Make sure to press the bell icon to never miss another update. I have made it super easy for you guys. So what you see here is my ultimate crypto guide. So all the information that you need to start with crypto, or if you are already uh, a seasoned vet in cryptocurrency, this is still very, very interesting to you. For starters, the crypto starter kit and the rest uh, is for everybody, for everybody. I also regularly uh, edit this list, add new things, so that it's always up to date. This will always be up to date. So if you're watching this video in five years, it's still, it's still totally up to date. So here we can see crypto safety hardware wallet. So these are things that I find uh, very important. So you click on crypto safety. What what is why why do you need? I'm 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 gonna cut the small talk, and I'm gonna tell you the safest way to store your cryptocurrencies is offline, in a cold wallet, in a hardware wallet. And these are the hardware wallets that I like that I know are trustworthy. I'm going to I'm going to tell you the four the four wallets that I believe uh, are great and you can use to store your cryptocurrencies safely. So there are other ways of storing cryptocurrency. You can have a paper wallet. Probably you have some coins on exchanges. What's very important to know is if the exchange get hacked, gets hacked, your coins could be could be gone. Maybe the exchange decides to pull out the plug. You don't own your cryptocurrency that's on the exchange. There's one thing that I want you to remember. Not your keys, not your coins. So you have, if you buy a hardware wallet, you have the private keys, but on an exchange, the exchange has your private keys. So if they decide to steal your coins, they can also do it. So that's why I immediately, I'm gonna show you the best way of storing cryptocurrencies. Let's start with Ledger. So you can click here and then click and boom, you go immediately to the website. So here you can find all the information that you need as well as Trezor. It's, I have, I bought my first ledger in, I don't know, a few years ago. It never let me down and I'm so happy that I bought it. It costs 59 euros, even though I think three years ago I paid in Bitcoin. So maybe I paid a thousand euros for my ledger at today's prices of $30,000. But it's one of the best investments I ever made because I also had crypto on exchanges and when the exchange goes down, bye-bye cryptocurrency. So it's possible that today you have some cryptocurrencies. Maybe you have some coins that are worth maybe one cent each, maybe five cents, maybe 10 cents. But wait 10 years, maybe in 10 years, it's a thousand dollars, maybe $10,000. Who knows? Who knows? I'm not an Oracle. I don't know where all the prices will go, but I see the markets evolve and the trend is it's going up, but especially Bitcoin. And then most, most coins will be useless in the future. But of course, you can always count on 
Bitcoin, in my opinion. So 59 euros, it's ranked according to what I believe is yeah the correct ranking from one from one to four. Next you have the Trezor. Safe place for your coins. Next the Cool Wallet and then the Cobalt Vault. So I'm not gonna read everything for you. You decide which one you want. I also have uh, a, a Nano X. Really cool. You need this. You need this. I'm telling you, you need, if you're serious about crypto, if you have, listen, if you have more than 60 euros worth of coins, why not, why not buy one? If you only have like $10 worth of coins, okay, you can leave them on the exchange. But if you, if you have Bitcoins and stuff, you need a hardware wallet. So all the info is on the websites. In summary, the ledger is the most trusted. Trezor is the most secure. Cool Wallet is the easiest for beginners. And the Kobo Vault is the most durable one. But they're all good. They're all good. But if you maybe if you're a beginner, maybe you want the Cool Wallet. Maybe you trust Ledger the most because it's it's the oldest. Maybe you prefer Trezor or maybe a Kobo Vault. Soon I'll um, I bought a Kobo Vault also and um, I'll do an unboxing video and more. So make sure to subscribe to my channel or check out my channel uh, for more interesting videos. So what was it again that I wanted you to remember? Not your keys not your coins and even though maybe currently on your exchange the coins are maybe only worth 100 dollars yes it's possible but maybe in 10 years they're worth a hundred thousand dollars who knows but don't be the guy that says ah oh, i should have done that trust me in my experience, I know you need this. You need this. You want to store your coins safely. I can't tell you enough. <laughs> this is so, so important. This is one of the one of the first things you should do when you're into crypto. Well, of course, first watch, uh, uh, check the crypto starter kit, and then and then you continue. It's, it's as easy as that, guys. I lost coins on exchanges, uh, many different ways I lost coins. So looking back then, I lost so many coins. And then after when you see the price years later of certain coins, you're like, wow, oh man, I lost thousands and thousands of dollars. Why didn't I buy a simple <laughs> safe hardware wallet where no one can steal my coins uh, of course unless you give them your private keys so what happens when you lose your wallet you can restore your wallet with your seed phrase with your private keys so if you lose this don't worry it's your it's your private keys that you need. So, for example, somebody steals this. Somebody steals your ledger, your treasure, your cool your cool wallet, Kobo vault, etc. Don't worry. <laughs> how do, how will they go on here? How? It's password. It's, it's so it's so well protected. They can do nothing with this. Nothing. So when somebody steals this, of course, when, if they have your private keys, you're, yes, you will lose everything. So make sure to store your private keys in a secure place. Because when you lose this, you just buy another one. You buy another one and you recover, you enter your seed phrase and boom, you have access again to all your funds. I can't stress this enough. I made I made uh, a few videos on this, but uh, this is so important, guys. Trust me. You need it. You find you'll find all the links in the video description as well. 
or the one-stop shop, the ultimate crypto guide. The link is also in the video description. Check it out. Have fun and leave leave me a comment. <laughs> leave me a comment. Uh, let me know. Did you lose coins in the last years? Tell me how you lost them. So everyone can also see that it is so important to store your cryptocurrencies safely. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. If you have any questions, ask them in the comment section below. Don't forget to read the video description for interesting info and uh, interesting links. And of course, make sure to subscribe to the crypto mining channel for more money making tips guys so i hope to welcome you all soon on the crypto mining channel have a great day and talk to you soon guys bye bye press the bell icon to never miss another update join the bitcoin revolution